Now, Christian clerics have urged the Nigerian government to prevent terrorist groups from exploiting their weaknesses to inflict their pain on citizens. They emphasize the ongoing security issues in Cardinal State, including the mass abduction of over 287 Korea students. The clerics attribute the lack of political will and government weakness to the ongoing insecurity. I pastored a local church for one year in Kuriga, 30 years ago. And this situation that has bedeviled our community, our land, is happening to those people because I know the people to some extent. They are not rich people, they are just peasant farmers. Where do they have money to pay the kind of amount the bandits are asking for? But that's the failure of our leadership in Nigeria, the failure of our security system, that evil people can come, torment innocent citizens, and go scot-free. But I want to challenge those in leadership that we must wake up and do and do what is right. They're taking advantage of the weakness of our government and tormenting us. And I hold government responsible for what is happening to innocent Nigeria. Now, former Evangelical Church winning uh, all Equa General Secretary, uh, Dr. Imadu Yunisa, emphasized that the twin brothers of hardship and insecurity urgent for quick release of students without arm. Government has the instrumentality to curb the hardship that we're in and also to curb the insecurity that we're in. The fact that the, this insecurity has lasted this long, the government should ask itself. Because um, they, they are duty bearers, and it is their responsibility to protect the citizens of this country. And UNGA will breed more insecurity. So I will charge this government to really get their acts together and curb the issue of hunger and suffering in the country. And perhaps we can have some respite in times of insecurity. If the government will not negotiate, then the government should take drastic steps not just to improve the economy, but drastic steps and security steps to uproot them from the source, the way they are. The government doesn't seem to be ready to take care of this problem. When they are ready, I'm sure security men are up to the task. Now, clerics uh, emphasize leadership, uh, quality, integrity, and human service, uh, ordering public office orders to protect lives and property and security and facilitate safe release of kidnapped victims. It's not easy in a very complicated community like this to serve and people tell you well done. In most cases, even when you put in your best, you have people accusing you for what is not. But uh, from the comments and the uh, words I had from people today, I always say, God, I thank you for the opportunity I have to serve. Uh, service to church and service to humanity is an experience or it's an opportunity for you to learn lessons. And having ended my tenure as Khan Chairman, uh, the church can say, oh, look, we are not just celebrating Khan Chairman, but we want to even begin from where you start as Khan Secretary and Khan Chairman. I only say I thank God and I thank all those who came for their support. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.